we're going to take about 15, 20 minutes, and we're going to just kind of give you an overview of, of Equus Financial. Um, I'm excited. You know, anytime I get a chance to talk about um, Equus Financial, I, uh, I love it. And, um, but, you know, when I, when I do an opportunity overview where I'm trying to condense it down to 15, 20 minutes, sometimes it's difficult to talk about um, because there's two, there's two distinct opportunities at Equus Financial, and, it's, and sometimes it's tough to cover each opportunity in the way that I would like to cover them. Uh, so it's always a challenge to do that. Um, and I like starting off letting you know what my challenge is so that you can bear with me because I'm going to try, try to do the best job I can of talking about both opportunities under the Equus Financial umbrella, which I think is the greatest company on the planet, especially the greatest business opportunity for somebody like me uh, to take advantage of and, and to be able to make multiple six figures. The, uh, so the two opportunities, number one, uh, seems like I'm always interviewing people that are looking to, to make money yesterday. Like, like these people have an urgency, um, whether they're already in sales, whether they're looking to get in sales, looking for a job, looking for a better job, looking for a better sales career. You know, these people, their, their urgency is to get going like immediately, start making money ASAP, which, hey, listen, I'm, I'm with you. Um, I'm, I understand 100%. Um, I was there in August of 2016 as well. So, uh, so I'm going to talk about our lead driven sales opportunity. You get off the line, you're going to know exactly what you need to do right now uh, to engage with Equus Financial and start putting money in your bank account immediately. Um, the second uh, opportunity is it's, it just stems from the first, really, um, but it's really uh, it's people that understand passive income. It's people that understand that by and large um, in the United States of America, we, we've all been taught how to be broke. Um, as funny as that sounds to say, it's true. We've all been taught to go to school, get a good education, get out and get a good job. We, we weren't taught business ownership. Uh, we weren't taught duplication. Um, you know, a guy like J. Paul Getty says, I'd much rather have 1% of 100 men's efforts versus 100% of my own efforts, but what are we taught? We're taught to go to school, get a good education, get out and get a good job, go work for somebody else and guarantee ourselves based on self-driven income, go out there and guarantee ourselves that we're gonna be broke not only on money, even though there's, there's a lot of people out there that make quite a bit of money and still are broke, because in self-driven income, the amount of money we make is driven by who? What's well, driven by us, hence the term self-driven. And so what we end up doing is creating a lifestyle that we simply can't participate in because we have no time to enjoy it. So I love, as much as I love talking to people that are ready to go and make money yesterday, I also love talking to people that, that share with me this story. Hey, I'm already making good money. I've, I've already got supposedly a good job. I've, I've already developed the business of my own. But let me tell you my frustration. My frustration is, is that I'm making more money than I ever thought I would make, but I, I have no time. Like every day I wake up, I'm running because I, if I don't go drive my income, nobody else is going to drive it. And it frustrates me to be able to make money, even though I love my spouse and my kids being able to enjoy the money I make, it's frustrating because I'm getting older every day and I'm not able to enjoy it. I've got to keep running and I don't see an end to it. I don't see an end. So I'm looking for a better way. Um, I'm looking for an answer. Like, like I'm frustrated. Tell, tell me the answer to that. And, and there is an answer to it. It's called system driven income because Unless you can ever um, switch gears from you driving your income, which you're, you're going to be the one that builds it, okay? But if you can't switch gears from self-driven to system-driven, then you're never going to have any time to enjoy it. And that, and that is the art of the deal. And that's what I love talking to people about because Equus Financial gives us that system uh, where we can duplicate ourselves. It's a transferable and duplicatable business system that allows us, the bigger our agencies get, the more systematized it gets, which gives us freedom because now we're not having to pick up the phone and answer every question um, that's coming from uh, people in our, in our agency. That, and that's a good thing. That's a good thing. So starting out with an exit strategy is a good thing. So 
starting off tonight, uh, again, thank you so much for joining us. My name is John Kite, and I, I develop distribution channels for top-rated insurance carriers. I'm looking for other people, maybe you, uh, who also want to develop distribution channels for top-rated insurance carriers. It pays really good. It's a great career. I love it. Uh, but by and large, I look for people that want to thrive in all areas of life, not just income. I look for people that want to thrive in all areas of their life. They want to grow in all areas of their life. Um, and so number one tonight uh, uh, is, our, is our sales opportunity. We serve middle-income America. We specialize in lead-driven sales. As a matter of fact, I've got some leads around here because I was, I had just gotten in from the field. Here's some of my leads right here. Uh, but I had just gotten in from the field and uh, I got a couple of um, couple of new leads and um, sat here and made a couple of calls. Got one of them at home and actually booked an appointment. So this is an example of a lead. We mail out a letter. The letter communicates something. And what people do is, is people fill it out and they mail it in. And then what we do is, is we as field underwriters, we call and we let them know that we're the field underwriter assigned to their request. Uh, and we book an appointment and we go sit down with them and we find out how we can help them. Um, I'm, I don't view what I do as sales, e even though I'll use the buzzword sales. I don't view what I do as sales because I don't sell anybody anything. I just go and I sit down with people and I connect with them. And then I just ultimately ask, why did you fill out this form? Like, what can I help you do? If you're looking for me to sell you on why you should protect your mortgage, or if you're looking for me to sell you on why you should take care of your final expenses, your end of life expenses versus having your family set up a GoFundMe, um, if you're looking for me to tell you those reasons, I'm not going to be very good at that because if I'm in that role of telling you why you should, then I'm in a sales role. And I just, I'd rather not be in that role. Here's what I'd rather be. I'd rather you tell me what you want to accomplish. And then what I'm going to do as a field underwriter is I'm going to tell you based on your age and your health, I'm going to tell you what carrier in our state is going to give you the best rate. And if you want to apply for coverage, I'll help you do that. Um, so lead-driven sales, guys, we serve middle-income America. It, it, it doesn't get any more difficult than what I just went through. Don't make it more difficult because it's not. And, um, and so serving middle-income America, guys, our passion is living benefits. With the type of insurance that we sell, with the type of coverage that we provide, not only does death trigger the payment of the face amount, so does critical illness diagnosis. That's right. So middle income America, um, when, uh, when mom gets diagnosed with breast cancer, God forbid, or when dad, uh, he wakes up on a Monday and he's not really feeling right. And he goes to the, to the hospital and lo and behold, he's had a heart attack or in, in the process of having a heart attack. Um, those types of things trigger uh, face amount and gets our clients cash. This is very important because in the world of mortgage protection, statistically speaking, more people lose mortgages due to uh, a critical illness diagnosis or a chronic illness diagnosis more so than death. And I, and I realize that's, uh, that's weird to say, but it's, it's very true. So um, serving Middle Income America, we're very passionate about lead driven sales. Um, for somebody just starting out with us, you're gonna make about $500 in commission per sale. A part-time agent typically will do one to two sales a week and a full-time agent five to seven sales a week. Do we have part-timers making more than that? Yes. Do we have full-timers making more than that? Of course. But on an average basis, if you're taking notes, the average commission on an average sale in mortgage protection is about $500 a sale. So part-timers, again, going out there and maybe maybe working a night a week or maybe even a Saturday afternoon can go out there and generate one to two sales a week. A full-timer, you're working three to four days a week. Um, so definitely, I, I would say five to seven uh, applications a week would be, uh, would be where you would want to be. Um, okay, so leads. There's two major sources where we create our leads from. I just held up a lead that was actually created for mortgage protection. So let's talk about mortgage protection first. So mortgage protection is 
um, the ability to take uh, the public data is created when somebody buys a home or refinances. So when somebody gets a new mortgage, whether it's buying a new home or refinancing, public data is created. We've got companies that actually mail to that data and about one and a half to two percent. I know, I know it's so hard to believe, but about one and a half to two percent will actually open up this mail. Are you that type of person? Like I'm not. Like if if somebody mailed me something and I don't know who it's from, I'm not opening up. But these people not only open up the letter that communicates mortgage protection. Okay, it's got this guy's name and it's got uh, the mortgage company. It's got how much the mortgage is, um, and it's got. Um, you know, just it just describes mortgage protection, pays off your mortgage if you pass away, uh, or helps make the mortgage payment if you were to get sick or hurt. And so about one and a half to two percent of the people, they fill it out and they mail it back into us. So a field underwriter like myself, I'm able to get that and I'm able again, this is this is our sales process. I call up this guy on the phone. Uh, now his name's not Bob, but I'm just gonna use Bob. Bob, my name is John Kite. My name's not going to ring a bell, but I'm the field underwriter that's been assigned to the request that you filled out and mailed into us this past week um, on that mortgage with Fifth Third Bank, and it looks like your mortgage amount is 125000 Do you remember filling out that form requesting information for mortgage protection? You do? Okay, great. Well, again, I'm the, I'm the field underwriter that's been assigned to your request. I'm going to target to get this information to you on Wednesday or Thursday of this upcoming week. What's the best time of day to stop it by? Morning, afternoon, or evening? And so, guys, if you're full time, you you want to set about twelve to fifteen of those appointments a week. If you will set twelve to fifteen appointments a week, I will promise you that you will be cash flowing somewhere around four to five thousand dollars every single week. Uh, if you're part time. You may want to set your goal at may, may, maybe maybe booking 12 to 15 appointments a month, okay? If that's not too too high a number for you, um, I know that that number is going to get you some results right there. So mortgage protection, serving middle-income America, helping them protect their mortgage. The second source of leads that we deal with, and I'm probably more excited about this opportunity because the amount of leads that we're able to generate across the United States of America, it, it's, it's a huge number because of the people that, that we mail to, because of the data that we mail to. Let, let me explain. So mortgage protection, like I said, is created from somebody buying a house or refinancing a house, okay? Final expense, leads are created from this, this generate, predominantly from this generation of people born between 1946 and 1964. We call that generation what? Baby boomers, okay? So 78 million people born between 1946 and 1964. Right now, there are over 10,000 people every single day turning age 65 in America. Guys, that's our target market, okay? So what we do is, is we mail out letters 55 to 80 year old, we mail out letters that talk about end of life expenses. And so about one and a half, same, same response rate, about one and a half to 2% will actually fill out that letter and they'll mail it back into us. And we've got a whole system for how you deal with those people. But I will promise you, it is a very rewarding thing when you sit down and you help Miss Betty take care of her end of life expenses that number one, she didn't think she would qualify for health wise. And number two, she didn't think she could afford it. So when you sit down and help her navigate that, and she's got that peace of mind that when she, when something does happen and she, she gets her tea time in heaven, um, that she knows she's got that, that, that her end of life expenses taken care of and her family's not going to have to go borrow money. Her family's not going to have to set up a GoFundMe or something like that. Um, it's, a, it's a very good thing, a uh, very rewarding uh, process. Uh, so guys, that's our sales system. So if you're ready to get started with us, number one, this is 100% commission, okay? So you need to know that. And if that deters you, then Equus Financial is not the right opportunity for you, okay? So 100% commission, you need to get your state insurance license. You do not need to have a health license, but you do need to have your state life insurance license. And we've actually got a program right now called Excel Testing, which is an online forum 
that you can plug into for $19. I think it's $19.99. Did your ears just mess up? I think I got stuck on the 99. But you're, um, but for $19.99, you can actually take this online course. And this course will prepare you to pass your state exam. Okay, so once you get licensed, we will get you contracted because we represent the top A rated insurance carriers across the United States of America. We represent them. It actually is what creates our opportunity because if you look at these companies like the Mutual of Omaha or Transamerica, Government Personnel Mutual, uh, Columbian Financial Group, um, if you look at these companies, they are great. Okay, it's a trillion dollar industry, right? The, you, you look at the stability of our economy being insurance companies, right? They own the biggest buildings in the biggest cities in America. Well, they're great at manufacturing products that are solutions for middle income America. They're great at paying us claims, okay? Not, well, not us, but they're great at paying us commissions. They're great at paying clients claims, but they're not good. And this is, a, what, this is our opportunity you remember I said I create distribution channels for top rated insurance carriers? These insurance carriers, they're horrible at getting their products, solutions into the hands of middle income America. So they're so bad at it, they're willing to pay people like me and you to go create those distribution channels, to go sit down in the, in the living rooms and dens and the kitchens across America and talk to people eyeball to eyeball, connect with them, care and connect and find out how can I help you? Because most people, they're not gonna buy insurance over the internet. They're not gonna buy insurance over the telephone. Okay, they wanna sit down with somebody and they wanna walk through the process. What can I qualify for? Who's gonna give me the best rate? How do I know I get the best rate? Yeah, you know, how do I know when I, when, I, when I submit this application and I'm riding down the road tomorrow and I hear a big lose commercial, right? You know, call Big Lou. He's on meds too. You know, I mean, uh, I mean, God, they just advertised the twenty-five million dollar life insurance policy for two cents a month. Like, what's up with that? You know, or when I ride down the road and I hear the select quote commercial, right? You know, uh, Bob just got a life insurance policy for eighty-four trillion dollars, and he's only paying two 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 dollars and twenty-five cents every thirty. You know, it's like, what's up with those commercials? So I want to be sure that I'm getting the very best rate that I can get. And so I love sitting down with somebody face to face. Um, so closing out of that, our opportunity, okay? We, when I said we partner with some of the top A-rated insurance carriers, this is exciting because again, they, they will pay us for creating distribution, okay? So the two ways of making money with Equus Financial and the two ways of creating distribution is number one on your own pen. That's you investing in these leads and going out there and helping people, okay? You can invest in leads. We've got leads that you can purchase from $0.50 cent all the way up to $50. So you have to decide how much money do I have to invest in? Can I, can I actually take a piece of paper and can I make a phone call and book an appointment? If you can, then you can make a lot of money with us. If you can't, then Equus is not going to be a great home for you, right? Um, don't mean to be so bold about it, but it's the truth. And, and, and on this overview tonight, I'm, I'm not trying to sell you. I'm not trying to, you know, make it sound like so good that you, you start walking through the process only to find out it's not for you. Nobody wants to do that. Listen, you're going to have time invested in getting your state life insurance license. Okay. If you're willing to go get your state life insurance license, I want you to know full well eyes wide open, head up, when you walk into this, what, what it's going to be. So number one, creating distribution from just you, okay? Calling the people, calling the leads, and booking appointments and going and helping them. Number two is building your agency. My passion, now, yes, when I'm in a home, my passion is living benefits. But can I tell you what my passion is more than that? My passion is the fact of seeing so many people um, being educated on how to be broke and they're out there waking up every day and they have to go get in traffic and they have to go do activities that they'd rather not be doing but the only reason they're doing those activities is because it produces a paycheck every two weeks and people are living that existence 
They're living life, wishing time away. Hurry up to Friday. Hurry up to Friday because I hate doing what I do. Friday's exciting. Saturday, you try to squeeze as much as you can into Saturday. And then Sunday by about 3 or 4 o'clock, that feeling comes over you again because it's like, man, i got to go back and do it all over again. So my passion is giving people hope via business ownership. My passion is to go out there and identify people that, that have what it takes to be business owners and to give them a system called Equus Financial and help them start making more money part-time than they do full-time. Help them start making four, five, six, seven thousand dollars a month part-time and then show them a whole world that they can get into full-time. Uh, we've got a kid up in Michigan right now, Andrew Pappas. You, you should get a hold of his lifestyle video. Uh, it's not going to be lifestyles of the rich and famous. You're not going to see Andrew fly away in his corporate jet. You're not going to see that. But what you're going to see is you're going to see a meter reader uh, who actually started with us part time. And, you know, he didn't get off to the fastest of starts. He, he just got into a few homes and he would call me up or he would call his Uncle Ollie up and, and he would go, hey, I'm sitting here with Bob and, and, and Janet, and you know Bob's you know 37 years old, and he's got um, uh, he's got high blood pressure and cholesterol, and, and, and his wife Janet, um, she had um, she had breast cancer 10 years ago, but she's a survivor, and she's all good now. You know, he would call us up on the phone, and we would walk him through what the best solution would be for that client. And you know, he made a few sales, but. He, he made enough sales for him to realize, hey, I don't have to go make $38,000 a year or however much he was making being a meter reader. I can go make a lot more than that. And so Andrew Pappas came on full time with us um, and he made right at $176,000 his first full year of being with Equus Financial. So think about that. A guy that goes from being a meter reader, uh, working 40 hours a week, making, making $38,000 a year, to being a full-time field underwriter making uh, well over six figures. And so it's very, very exciting. So am I passionate about sharing that same system that worked for Andrew? Am I passionate about sharing with other people? You better believe I am. Why? Because when you put hope in a family, you change marriages, you change mummies and daddies, you change everything about the home when they've got hope that their future can be better than what it is right now working jobs that they hate. Um, as I close tonight, I do want to let you know there's three things that I look for. I know a while ago I said I'm looking for people that want to thrive in life, and that's true, but there's three specific things that I look for. Number one, and these are all desires. Number one, I look for a desire for somebody to simply want to make more money than a typical job's willing to pay. Are you frustrated going and working and giving the best hours of your best days, of your best weeks, of your best months, you know, for the amount of money you make. I look for people that want to make more money than the average job is willing to pay. Number two, I look for people that want to set their own schedule. They love waking up and knowing that, you know what, they can set their own schedule and they can go work as hard as they want to on Monday and Tuesday. And if they want to take off Wednesday and Thursday and Friday, they can. They want to go work their butt off Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday and take off Thursday and Friday and go play golf, they can. It's called being a business owner and setting your own schedule. I look for people that love that. And then number three, I look for people that simply have a desire to be financially free. To have money coming in because you've built an agency and you've taught people how to help people. And now you've got not only income coming in, but you also have time to enjoy it. I look for people that want lifestyle. And you can't have lifestyle unless you're able to combine money with time. Money without time and time without money only equals frustration. 